shooting in the village was an incredible experience. Where we shot The Green Inferno is farther up the Amazon than any other feature film has shot before. We had to take like an hour boat ride to the village. It was like the very last village on this boat ride where you feel like at the end of it, are you ever going to get there? It's just so remote. It was crazy. It wasn't like being on set. You were basically living, breathing the movie the whole time. Like, I had no idea what to expect going to the jungle every day. Now I'm finally, you know, doing a film where I'm actually there in the location, experiencing, you know, the atmosphere and everything. It was like kind of being in paradise. We were told it was going to be a tough shoot and it's not an easy location to film. This would be the day to test their patience. Because you'll have a location, you'll love it, you'll film it, and you come back two days later and it's been completely washed away. Half of our beaches that we shot at are already, already disappearing. It was a huge challenge for us. But at the end, it felt like more than a movie shoot. It was, it was something really special for all of us. Hello, Valerie here with another So You Think You Know movies. Now, let's start with onset injuries, with Jennifer Lawrence being left temporarily deaf in one ear while shooting The Hunger Games Catching Fire. Sorry, what was that you said? Huh? And Nikki Reed injured her hands during the shooting of Twilight and had to wear gloves to cover them up. Okay, moving on, billionaire cameos with Sir Richard Branson having a blink and you miss it cameo in Casino Royale. Download our Film Is Now app, available for both Android and iOS. Bye bye.